Acres Auction, sale 232, video file for lot 884, suffragettes and unequal rights. This is fairly typical of the era. A woman very stridently demanding the vote. Give me a vote and see what I'll do. A perfect woman nobly planned to warm, to warn rather, to comfort and command. From one of the girls. Yes, she has equality, no doubt. What it will come to, then they will be satisfied. These um, Arabian-type pants were uh, the subject of great ridicule. <laughs> this is rather lovely. Top hat with a great big hat pin through it, uh, smoking and walking sticks and dressed like men. Beautiful card. The Lady Gunner. <laughs> Passing the poor old bird to smithereens. The ideal husband who does all the washing. Votes for the ladies, the newspaper calls. Tragian. Great Scott. And in my time I've had the belly things thrown at me. I'll be cross, Ar Arabella. I'll be cross. Though you have your women's rights, I'm the boss. Not in that household, methinks. The lady's friend. <laughs> oh, women policemen, women sailors, what is the world coming to? The henpecked husband. Some things never change. Her night out at the club. All good things club together to give you a happy and restful Christmas. The young men have to keep off the grass. Oh dear, look at this one. Woman is doing the work of man, so she'll wear the trousers if she can, and it's quite easy to prophesy what pa will look like by and by. Friends between man and woman, there is little difference. Man in the crowd, three cheers for the little difference. I hear your wife does a little poker work in the evenings. Is it true? Cynicus. We're not supposed to be amused by this stuff. However, however, who can help laughing when they're funny? Mary had a little lamb who couldn't say her no, and everywhere that Mary went, the lamb was sure to go. <laughs> Oh dear, leap year. Last leap year I was too busy making munitions, but look out for yourselves this year, you okay. men. <laughs> oh yes, they were called harem pants. Are you swanking in your harem skirt? Look, Bill, this old gal's only got a pair of trousers on. When did they breach you, auntie? 